Speaking with KV Island manager Steve Tilson following our 1-0 defeat against Berrytown at the Prospect Stadium. Steve, a dominant performance ending in defeat. How did you see the match? I think you just said it there. I think it was a smash and grab. Um, they've had one chance, you know, fantastic ball in, and, and the boys got in between the two centre-halves and scored with a head up. But outside of that, we've absolutely dominated the game from almost start to finish. We've had three one-on-ones in the first half. You know, it's only down to our our um, poor end product that we haven't won the game tonight. Um, you know, we could, we could have won by three or four and they couldn't have had any complaints. Um, so that, you know, from that point of view, disappointing because, you know, we didn't play well Saturday and we end up winning 2-0. We've, for me, totally dominated the game today and we've, we've come away losing 1-0. So that's disappointing. Um, but that's, that's football and, you, like I say, you have to move on. We've got, you know, two tough away games now, and, and we, you know, we have got to move on and, and see how we we bounce back from, um, you know, from the one 0 defeat tonight. Big decision on the stroke of half time saw the referee turn down a penalty appeal for a foul on Bradley Woods Garnis. Uh, what was your view of the incident? Yeah, it's a penalty. Uh, for me, the performance of the ref the second half proved that it was a penalty in the first half because he gave us nearly everything in the second half trying to. I think he, he realised he's made a mistake. He wouldn't admit that, but um, I think everyone in the everyone in the ground thought it was a penalty. Um, I also thought Jay Curran when he got through one on one and put it wide just before his his shot inside the box and put it wide, he's got clipped from behind. For me, that's a penalty as well. Um, and I say I, I think the, the ref tried to move him up second half, and but the damage was done. Finally, on to a couple of tough away trips now with Bognor Regis and Lower Stuff coming up next. Uh, what would a good return from these matches be in your eyes? Definitely two tough away games, that's for sure. Um, you know, I think if we could, if if we could win one of the two, would be a good return. But obviously, we want to try and win, you know, both. But I think, you know, if we if we could come away winning one out of the two games, um, you know, that'd be a decent return because you know both sides are right up there so yeah we know we know it's going to be tough and that's why it's disappointing tonight not to to get them three points we'd have found ourselves in second place you know and that and that gives you a bit more confidence going into them two games thanks steve cheers glenn